Good morning, Garlotta gang. So as you guys can tell today, apparently we're not in California. Apparently we're somewhere like Seattle. Look at this. Look at how much rain we have gotten. It's kind of insane, but uh, so what that means is there's no scooter riding today. But that's okay with me because for today's video idea, we do not need to ride scooters. Okay, so we have planned for today's video what something called alcohol paint. I, I believe it's something like that. I've seen this one other time on YouTube, so completely all the credit goes to Undialed. Um, but when they did it, they didn't show where they bought the stuff. Same exact person that gave them the idea actually came to Scooter Zone a couple of weeks back and they told me I can get the stuff at Michael's. So that's what I'm coming here today for. I'm coming here to get some. So actually, it's actually not called alcohol paint, it's called alcohol ink. What basically happens is you set the ink on fire and then it goes and turns into like kind of a paint and it dyes whatever you're doing. So it's pretty cool. 2,000 years later. Okay, so update everyone. We found the alcohol ink. It is $11.99. I think I'm just gonna get this color. Probably get the other colors just in case. This is gonna be an expensive buy. Um, like I said, a long time ago I saw Undialed make a video about this where they painted forks and I just thought it looked so cool. And I've wanted to do it, but I kind of wanted to wait. And on a rainy day like this, what else am I gonna do? So we got the stuff. Now I need to go over to Target so I can get some oven cleaner so I can get all the anodized paint off of my deck because I want my deck raw so I can get all the colors on there as much as possible. Target's literally right there, so I'm not probably gonna bring my camera or the stuff as fast as possible. So I'll see you guys back at home. All right, you guys, we are back at my house. We are actually in my room. Sorry for the mess. My bed is not made because I'm a guy. All right, so what we're going to be doing right now is disassembling my scooter, and then we can, then we can start spray painting the oven cleaner. By the way, by the way, if you guys are under the age of 18, make sure you guys have a parent supervision when you guys are using oven cleaner. Because it will literally eat your flesh off of your fingers, and then you guys will have no fingers. So make sure you guys have your parent supervision when you're messing with this kind of stuff. It's coming magic like a replay, rolling down the freeway. All right, so right now it's a very sad moment because uh, as you guys do know, I do have my $10,000 Gucci grip tape. If you guys want to see a designer grip tape, of course, give this video a big thumbs up and also comment down below any designer brand down below and we will make the grip tape for it. But with that now, we need to say goodbye to the Gucci grip. The father you brings me to tears. It's been so many years. I'm finally seeing clear. All right, you guys, when you guys mess with oven cleaner, one thing you definitely are gonna want are gloves to protect your hands, because if this stuff gets on your hands, like I said earlier, it's gonna eat your fingers away. So the step we got is easy off oven cleaner. So this is fume free, so we don't have to be breathing in any toxic stuff. But from my understanding, what we do is we spray it on, we spray it on, leave it on there for about 10 minutes, and then it just comes wiping off. So that's the plan, hope it works. <laughs> All right, so let's do it on the floor. Okay. Stuff that we're going to be doing is my deck and, of course, my wheels. Like I said, this stuff is extremely, extremely bad for you. So I used to use Easy Off on all kinds of anodized scooter parts. When you when you use Easy Off on scooter parts or bike parts or whatever you're doing that have like a powder coat on them it comes off chunky and it's really hard to get off it doesn't wipe off but with anodizing it just once you leave it on there for like 10 minutes it should just wipe right off and it's and that's it <laughs> that's, all, that's all it is then we get to play with fire <laughs> oh yeah look at that already i don't know what's my deal with playing with acid but i seem to play with acid a lot you remember acid versus videos when i almost killed myself that was the closest time I think I ever came to death. That's what they say not to do in your house. You can do the other side of them. Sure, they're good. Maybe. What? What's the problem? Shut that stuff, man. Oh my god. Hmm. We're gonna go. 
put these st this stuff in the garage so it's out of harm's way. You think he's gonna work? Probably. I shouldn't touch this. Very I don't know. Never messed with fume free easy off. I've only used the super heavy duty stuff. This is heavy duty. Yeah, this is the new one. This has had nanotechnology. It's scent free. It's kind of like the new air freshener. So scent free. Lemon scent. Alright you guys, so we try to get off the deck and never get, never get oven cleaner that is fumeless because as you guys can see, this really didn't do much. Didn't do anything on powder coated, which this deck is powder coated and the wheels are anodized and it kind of didn't do anything to either of them. So yeah, so I had to basically sand off the whole head too. I don't really care about the little red things right around here because that's all going to be covered up. But let's start going and trying to paint. Like I said, I have no idea how to use this stuff, but what this is, it is called alcohol ink, and you can buy it at Michael's. It's about $11.99 for the pack. <coughs> I, don't, I don't even know if I'm even supposed to shake it. All right, uh, let's move this a little bit right over there. Let's probably start with green first. Let's go like this. This is already my favorite thing to do. Is that bad? I thought this was going to be a lot different on how to do, okay, there we go. That kind of didn't really, that just took over completely. Hey. Screw that. I'll just go with a lot of colors. We're just going to go with a lot of colors now. Here now is put some rubbing alcohol so it kind of blends in a little bit more from my understanding. By the way, the only video that I've seen wasn't dialed, so if they didn't do it necessarily right, that means I'm doing it way worse than they are, because, I mean, it doesn't look that bad. It looks kind of cool. All right, let's go, I don't even know what color this is. Look like brown to me. All right, so now, guys, we got a torch. <laughs> Thanks to me. Thanks to me. Thanks to this guy. <laughs> Dipping? That looks kind of cool so far, huh? You like it? Okay, you know what? We're just gonna stay away from the red. All right, you guys, for the record, I thought this was gonna be a lot quicker and a lot easier and a lot cooler looking, but that looks actually kind of cool. It's looking there. I think that what's messing it up right now is the brown. Let's see, let's get some more colors up from that. So that it actually like, gets on the table. Ooh, I like it. That looks kind of sick, I think. Hey, your wolf's sitting right here, dude. Okay? Your wolf's right here. Hey. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Take a thumbnail. That looks kind of cool, though. It definitely like, kind of smoothed it out. Jonathan, mm -hmm. I'd recommend standing a little bit back because we're about to torch this again. Probably oh, we're gonna catch fire to the whole house. <laughs> Ready? There we go. Oh, Get away. <laughs> I didn't panic at all. Sorry. Okay, that that worked. Not really, but we got to. Clickbait to save my house caught on fire. <laughs> yeah, we almost literally caught the house on fire. They almost you will, caught the house on fire. You will both die. It, this thing melted. I <laughs> We're not going to set the thing on fire like that quite again because that was a bad idea and the house almost burnt down. And 
Stuff like that. It was all bad. Um, so we're not gonna do that again. People are gonna think that Dad's down somewhere or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, Wish me luck on the next side. <laughs> Okay, this is like really difficult. All right, here we go. Oh, shoot, that was on fire. That movie or that TV show is weird. The one that you just played a little bit of. End of the. Wait, that was on fire. Is that why those tips are? Yeah, they melted off. so much for watching please like comment and subscribe follow me down in the description on Instagram if you guys want to see more videos on like things like this because look at this this is so cool if you guys want to see more videos like this like DIYs like painting suitor decks um, I'm probably gonna keep doing this to a couple other decks but yeah I'll see you guys tomorrow peace out